Okay, David, well, we had a, a wide-ranging interview with uh, Sheriff Garcia, and you know, it's interesting, uh, the jail has lots of problems. Those are problems that, of course, didn't originate with this sheriff. They've been around for a long time, probably didn't originate with Tommy Thomas either. But there are things that can be done to reduce that jail population. The sheriff obviously has the ability to do some things. He's going to need help from the DA's office. He's going to need help from the judges. Uh, there's no question about it. I don't think the taxpayers want to pay for a new jail until you try everything else. Well, we don't have the, we don't have the money to uh, pay for a new jail, really. You know, that's an expensive item. Or the item. staff, for that matter. Well, he's, had, he had trouble. He's, he's, he's soliciting the crew here to become detention <laughs> that's officers. That's right. I think he would have taken you in <laughs> as well. That's pretty desperate. <laughs> yeah, but you know, um, I'm surprised that he wasn't more uh, energetic in, in putting down the new jail idea. You know, because there are so many ways to reduce that population other than that. And I hope I wasn't being, did, did you think I was unfair when I was asking him as a law enforcement, head law enforcement guy to take responsibility for all of the solutions for jail crowding? Well, I, I think it's fair. He could be one of the people who helps coordinate the solution. Uh, I don't think there's any question about that. And you know, you talked about alternative programs. I think the county spends 20 million a year on sending inmates to Louisiana. Well, what I we mean could was, take that money and better deploy it for diversion programs for the mentally ill and others. There it needs would make to be, sense. but there, there needs Somebody to be, needs a, to be a leader. There needs to be a leader, right? And you cannot expect judges to lead. There, judges, there, there's too many of them. There's too many of them. No, not any one of them is in charge, and they don't. They don't have the political stroke. He does. Well. And he has the responsibility, and he and 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 it's serious. And he's about to be sued by the Fed, so it seems to me well, he should come up with yeah, it. Yeah, I mean, in, in his defense, he's only been in office six months, and he's probably learning the job at this point, still at this point, because it's a challenging I job. Agree. But I think you're right. He so, needs to be the leader on this issue. We'll give him 90 more days. Okay. Yeah, that's it. <laughs>